and our final stop of the trip for theme parks is the SeaWorld Christmas Experience. And I'm definitely excited for this, especially since I get 50% off merchandise here. This is going to be fun. So all about the merch, all about the merch. And over in the distance beyond that lighthouse, you can see a Christmas tree all lit up with gigantic ornaments, garland everywhere. Wow, this looks amazing. I'm ready to get this party started. Look at these awesome little trees. They look like they're made of ribbons and confetti. Ribbons, yeah. Is committed to the health right at the front of the park. Of all of our guests and employees. And my favorite, the merch. Oh, that's cute, honey. Oh, wow. Looky here. They've got cups and ornaments and all kinds of cool stuff here. And guest services is looking all decked out. Check out these still performers. Awesome, you got a reindeer and an elf, a candy elf, an elf who loves candy. Yeah, that's awesome. I did, I did, I did. You have not seen that movie. I have not. I, well, I have saw, I saw 20 minutes of it. I have it. I know, me too. I'm telling him he has to. I love that home alone. And we are now heading into the dining and shopping area. Check out this awesome arch going across here with these two nutcrackers. And right around the corner. And as soon as you pass through that, you can really see this place come to life. All the garland and all the uh, hanging decorations. This is starting to look really, really, really awesome. And here is our, our first uh, food stand, Holiday Cheers. Craft brews, mistletoe margarita, cotton candy, caramel corn. And right across from that is this little Christmas store where you can find all your Rudolph merch. And just take a look at all this. Oh, nice Rudolph shirt here. Yukon mm -hmm. Cornelius, Bumble, that Rudolph shirt that I bought the other day. All right, and we are inside the snow globe. Oh my God, look at all this. This is so cool. Whoa, dude. Ah. All right, let's get out of here. We just got our pictures taken. Look at that. All right, and if you ever come here to do this, make sure you close this door before opening this one. Otherwise, the seat will deflate and it will suck for everybody. Don't be that person. Take it from me. All right. All right. Just look at this. Wow. You see those two candy canes in the background? That big wreath on the smokehouse, the Voyage smokehouse. And the big snowflake. What? Oh, fire grill. Sea fire grill. Oh no, the next people. Oh no. That's why I'm like, no, don't. They deflated it, oh god. That's funny. And here's another look at the snow globe and these two candy canes. And check out this giant reef at Voyager's Smokehouse. Ribs, chicken, and brisket. 
possum. Elmo's Christmas wish. And just look at all these red Christmas trees and this big snowman in front of this waterfall here. And here's a closer look at all these red trees and this awesome photo op with trees and presents and a big snowman, a big jolly snowman. Over here at the Shark Wreck Reef, we've got some really nice garland and we've got this beautiful tree down here and purple garland everywhere. Take a look at that. Awesome. And look at all these purple lights all over these trees. I cannot wait to see this at night. This looks freaking awesome. And all the purple garland here at the, uh, the shark section of SeaWorld. I mean, look at this light canopy by Waterway Grill. This awesome looking Christmas tree right beside it. And right here, another awesome Christmas tree. And we have frog something around. All right. Oh, yeah? And we are making our way. To Sesame Street land and enjoying this nice Christmas village look with this uh, pretzel kitchen. And there it is, Sesame Street land. So we stopped by the pretzel kitchen to get some lunch before the party begins. And I've got this uh, pretzel, sorry for the watered up napkins. So I got this pretzel with beer cheese sauce. And what'd you get? The, pit, um, the cheese pizza pretzel. Cheese pizza pretzel with the, the marinara. So this is gonna be good. We're gonna, and we got an all day cup, which they filled with the icing. And what did you get? What kind of beer, honey? It's a cider. Cider, oh nice. Oh, this is gonna be good. All right, so we got our tasting card, and they ran out of lanyards before we got our card. So we'll hopefully get a lanyard somewhere else before we lose this card. But anyways, we got the carnitas tachos. We're going to split these. Unfortunately, they don't have melted cheese on it. See, what are you thinking? Shredded cheese, like, not off to a good start. That's the dumbest idea ever. But hopefully these actually taste good. But, uh, yeah, really, SeaWorld. Um, anyways, here we go. Let's see if... What we all agree on is the worst theme park for uh, food can uh, can show us something for their Christmas offerings. Um, so yeah, these tachas were actually really good. They were nice and crunchy. Um, they were, they, what, what Stella? Do you like them? I, I liked them, what do you think? I thought they were nice and crunchy. Um, I think everything just kind of flowed together well. Uh, it would have been better if they had like cheese sauce versus I like the other cheese. ones better. The ones at, at Bush Gardens were definitely better, but these are not bad. Um, like it's it's really impressive. And here we are by Altitude Burgers. Look at the lights already showing in the trees here. And over here you have this really nice fireplace where you can sit around and enjoy a fire and photos of Santa with this winter wonderland forest full of Christmas trees and one big decorated one in the middle I love how they 
kind of give it like a realistic look back here and they have that backdrop. Then you go up there, you got dinner with Santa. The Freestyle Machines, they have self pull chill with vanilla and they have it in diet too. So we're gonna probably try the diet vanilla self pull chill. This looks interesting. And we'll tell you guys what we think of it. I don't know. All right, so we have here oh my God. more holiday stuff, more Christmas merch. Santa's favorite. We've got this beautiful tree, and we are right past Altitude Burgers. Nice. Nutcrackers, really nice looking nutcrackers here. And there's Rudolph. And that Rudolph blanket, the Bumble blanket. Oh, those are awesome. And here is an overview of the store. Sorry, I'm walking backwards, so it might be a little shaky. All right, so we did it. We've got some South Pole Vanilla Chill. Um, I've taken a sip of this already. It tastes almost like a uh, vanilla float, like some sort of float, um, but without the ice cream and stuff. It's actually really good. It's got a really good vanilla taste to it. Here, try it out. It looks disgusting. It's vanilla. It tastes like vanilla Dump it out. No. That is the South Pole Vanilla Chill. It's like cream soda. Yeah, it's, it's pretty good. Cream soda is what it's Got a good is. vanilla vanilla taste to it. Wait, do you want to act like we got something from the floor? No. And over here is where the ice skating show is going to take place a little later on today. So we're going to go check that out. And you can see Icebreaker, the new SeaWorld's roller coaster. We'll be ready soon, and we're real excited. Just look at all these Christmas trees coming out of the water. This is so awesome. Look at this. Wow. Vanilla vodka, peppermint schnapps, white chocolate liqueur, and crushed candy cane. And we also got the uh, hazel nutty nut cracker, Imperial Sweet Stout. So uh, it's from Ivanhoe Park Brewing Company. So yeah, this will be fun for what? Um, so we can split it. No, yeah, just just we'll, we'll split it. Girls are getting the s'mores cheesecake waffle cone, and. Um, since they're sharing, they're going to put it in the cup and put the waffle cone on top. This looks great though, wow. Thank you. Man, oh man, oh man. How is it, girls? All right, I'd go ahead and sip that beer. All right, so we got this mistletoe margarita. That's a love growth, tequila, cranberry, and lime. So here it is, the mistletoe margarita. What do you think about the mistletoe margarita? Will you kiss me if I put this over our heads? No, please stop. Just drink it. Mmm. Oh my god, that's like... Cranberry juice. Dude, it's like cranberry juice. Cranberry it's and lime. so good. Oh, man. Wow, yeah, the mistletoe margarita's got it going on, dude. She said about five, it should open. Should we go over there and see? What's the drink? Uh oh, girls. Right, they just dumped it down above the tree. We can walk 
over that way and see yeah. if it opens and then go the other way to Mako. No, I just want to go to Mako. Okay, well, we're trying to like see if this food's open. Mama, Mama says um, I need one of those child leashes. And next on the uh, tasting menu, we've got the lamb chops. They are very small, but I'm sure they're really good. And they come with a root vegetable hash. Um, so yeah, this looks awesome. We're gonna try this out. And also we got this holiday eggnog. Um, it's eggnog with some kind of alcohol in it. I forgot. I think it's peppermint eggnog. Peppermint eggnog, yeah, it's a peppermint eggnog. That's right. So this is a spike drink, uh, peppermint eggnog. All right, and we're gonna take into this. All right, so um, we uh, tried this lamb. Um, I thought the lamb was all right. It wasn't anything special, um, but it wasn't bad. Uh, the girls aren't ready for that kind of thing yet. Um, what did you think of yours, honey? Yeah, I, I liked it. The lamb fine. I just it's a lot of potatoes. I'm not a potato person. I mean, the potatoes. Yeah. Tastes good, but... So are these sweet potatoes or what? I think so. Yeah. Um, do you like it, Lola? No. Okay. How about you, Stella? What were your thoughts on the lamb? Okay. It tasted like chips. I didn't know that he worked. What? 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 I just took a bite out of the lamb, and it's green. Nova, don't buy. Not worth it. Go get something else. Go get macaroni. Go get some McDonald's. Go get to eat at Harry Potter Land. It actually used your real money. For all of us, it was getting like $40. All right, so that was stop five. Number six is where the mac and cheese bowls are. So the next one on in the turkey stack. Wow, this holiday uh, peppermint oh. eggnog that you get where you get the lamb chops is actually really good. I love this. What do you think of that eggnog, honey? Yeah, it's that's really good. It, uh, to me, it was like, um, yeah. it tasted like a vanilla frappuccino with peppermint. Ooh, it is really good, wow. Yeah, I'm loving this. I drink vanilla frappuccinos. All right, and now the lights are really starting to shine here. And you're beginning to see what this place has to offer. The Christmas spirit of SeaWorld. And it looks stunning. These red trees that we passed by earlier are now all lit up. Let them run out. All right. And check out this awesome display of lights again from another angle. Look! How that snowflake perfectly fits that white store over there. And I cannot wait to see the trees in the water light up. Wow. Check this out. Wow. All right, so here we've got the turkey stack, the holiday stack. Um, and this has got underneath stuffing and mashed potatoes. And it's got this side of bread here. Um, this is the lobster mac and cheese. So they've got the mac and cheese, um, these chunks of lobster, and they've topped it with shredded cheese. And the girls. Forks. All right, so we're gonna dig into this. Dunder and Blitz and Spiced Ale. Dunder and Blitz and Spiced Ale. What do you think about that? Spicy. Spicy. All right. Good, good, good. All right. How's the mac and cheese, girls? Oh, oh. How is it? Is it good? It's better than the stuff you had on Halloween. Cheers. <laughs> All right. 
Well, this does kind of remind me of Bush Gardens. Look how it's got the bushes lit up, lit up and we've got this big tree over here with stars. This is awesome. Wow, this is just beautiful. Wow, just look at this. This is amazing. Those are scallops, baby. You guys have a scallop each, and then you got to spread the shrimp. So we got the sea scallops right and the, uh, what is this? Uh, the dynamite shrimp. Dynamite shrimp. Like no, oh, sort of like bang bang. Oh, and look at these scallops. These are huge. We love scallops in this house. So, oh man. The mint julep. That's what that drink is. Is awesome. And just look, look at these trees. This is nuts. Whoa. Don't drop that. This is just incredible. Like, this uh -huh. is dazzling right here, man. This is something unique and special. So yeah, this is risotto that came with the scallops, and the scallops are big, they were juicy, they were so good, they were just phenomenal. Um, this shrimp is no joke, like, it had the girls crying here. It's pretty hot, but it's good. And I, I love, love the, uh, the veggie coleslaw that comes with it. It's, it looks like it's got zucchini, it's really, really good, like I'm about to eat. I yeah. just love veggies, and we're gonna eat this. Do you want some belly? No. What do you want? <laughs> so yeah, this is by far my favorite. Like, I like this stand in the place of the lobster mac and cheese. Um, those are my two favorite places to visit. Those are the two must tries, and uh, they've got great cocktails and uh, great beer. So, at the other one. So yeah, this is uh, awesome. Oh, this julep is so good. Wow, this just looks amazing. So here we have this fantastic display of Christmas trees. And let's see if we can get a closer look at this. Like this, I've never seen anything like this. This is one of the most incredible things I've ever seen as far as any kind of theme park Christmas display. It's, it's very unique, and it's just breathtaking to see it. A beautiful scene here. And there are a lot of people here. It is a Friday night though. Yeah, 
Yeah, I'm not hungry either. I'll take another drink though. All right, so we're here at Sliders That Slay. You want a slider that slays? Oh, dude, get me one then. You want to split it or you want to just get each one? Girls, quit like waving me. Bing Crosby. They have hot chocolate. They have paper hot chocolate. Oh, wow. Marshmallow, white chocolate. All right, so we're over here and uh, we've got the Elf's Elixir and it's got these little uh, gingerbread candies in them. So that's the Elf's Elixir and that's the seasonal brew, seasonal porter or something like that. It's good. And like this it. is the chicken slider. It's like a hot chicken slider. Mm -hmm. So it's like- It's got some sort of apricot. Apricot glaze. Habanero glaze. Yeah. Pickles and, and coleslaw. coleslaw. pickles. But yeah, check that out, man. The Elf's Elixir. We're, we're gonna, we're gonna have fun up. with this. All right, so the chicken slider was good. It kind of reminded me of a deli sandwich, cold bread, but you know, it had the hot chicken on it with the, uh, the yeah, the slaw and the glaze. Like it was like a habanero, yeah, and pickles. Love pickles. Yeah, we love pickles. Big fan of pickles. Oh yeah. Here. Oh yeah. So um, that was a great sandwich. The slider. We did the slider. Um, the Elf Elixir was good. I, I, I did enjoy the Elf Elixir. And uh, now we're going to drink this beer. And uh, have, have you tasted the beer yet? I did. It's good. It's good? Okay. She likes it, so she's picky. I'll drink anything that has alcohol in it. <laughs> <laughs> I'll drink motor oil that has alcohol in it. But yeah, so far, so good. This has been very impressive. Take a look at the sea of lights. This is just an amazing sight. All right, so we're right here by this awesome canopy. And just take a look at that. Here's a close up of this awesome, stylish tree. And right beside it, 
is this really cool light canopy. And just check that out. All right, what you got there? Christmas tag. It's vodka. And it's bonin flavored pomegranate, golden turmeric, Granny Smith apple, and lemonade. Yours is holiday whiskey sour with Jack Daniels winter cider, pomegranate, bonin, and cranberry sour. Yeah, uh, mine tastes like, it tastes like, like Thanksgiving cranberry careful, sauce. Careful. Like, yeah, girls, don't, don't mess with the table. How about yours? What is yours like? What would you, how would you describe yours? Here, you take it. Hold on one it's second. A, um, it's like a spicy apple cider drink. Oh, okay. One minute. Let me uh, drink a little it's, bit. So, I, I thought that one tasted like cranberry sauce. What about you? Um, I taste the whiskey. Yeah. And on, on both of them, they're very syrupy, which is like my reservations about the drinks because it's like this moaning syrup and that moaning syrup and this moaning syrup, but there's like a shot of liquor in here. And I don't really like something that's like, it's very syrupy. Like, I'm just not a really sweet person. I like drinks that taste good, but um, I don't like it when it's syrupy and it's, it's syrupy Overwhelmingly sweet, yeah. So I just, I worry about the calories and and well, I just don't really like things that are all sweet. Okay. It tastes good, but yeah, it's, it's syrupy. I think this is, you know, it, yeah, it does taste good. It is a, it is pretty. It's overwhelmingly. Yeah, it, it's overwhelmingly sweet. Um, but it is a good drink. But yeah, it's, uh, it's pretty heavy on the sweet side. Mm -hmm. That was my reservations about coming here. And I do here think they are. are good. I mean, they're good. I like these drinks. They're definitely good drinks. But yeah. Um, that Christmas town definitely tasted like a cider. Like it was just all things Christmas and an overwhelming. Like syrupy. Yeah. Like almost apple, like a liquid syrupy. It was like apple. a whole apple pie condensed into one little glass. Like, yeah. Maybe like two apple pies. No, but it was good. I mean, it's definitely a, definitely a holiday drink. Um, both of them are very good. And this is just such a perfect walk through a Christmas wonderland that is the SeaWorld Christmas celebration. And we're just having such a great time here. Oh man, back over here to Sesame Street. And check these lights out, these dual colored lights. Man, orcas. And we're heading back over through Sesame Street. I think. I don't know where they are. Icy. To what? They want an icy refill. They want an icy refill. Yo. All right, so we're gonna get an icy refill at this this uh, place that sells like really odd tasting, uh, <laughs> to put it kindly, pretzels. I did not like these pretzels at all. They were probably the worst pretzels I've ever had. But uh, the, ta the food here on the tasting cards was really good. So that I can appreciate. Sounds like they have an orca show going on. And check this out. Turning around from where I last was and it's just an amazing sight. All right. So we're gonna get Sesame Street again. And over by the orcas, we've got a little path of lit up trees. And look at that. It's like this was made for Christmas. Kind of similar to how Universal does their New York section. And here's a look at the trees as you come in to Sesame Street.
Man, I gotta hunt the fan down now. You're just way ahead of me. Yeah, I see him. But, uh, anyways, this is Sesame Street at night. And we'll do a look in reverse. This is amazing. It's nice. I mean, it's fairly simple, but it does give you that Christmas town charm. And I could definitely appreciate that. Now, we are walking over to the area where they have uh, the Santa. Oh, God. She farted! Check this out, wow, this is she really... She farted! Nice. Oh, man. Gross. There they are with Tickle Me Elmo. Awesome. All right. And now we're making our way out of Sesame Street Land, which it was uh, pretty nice. Yeah, yeah, I don't need any more Tachis. I mean, the Tachis were okay, but yeah, it's a, it's a one and done thing. It's not, yeah, Tachis, Tachos. Look at all these wonderful lights here. And one thing I did not get last time was this. It's Elmo and whatever that red dude's name is. No, I mean, it's Cookie Monster. And I think there's like a big red dude and a little red dude. I think that's, that might be Elmo actually. I don't know, I never watched Sesame Street really. It wasn't my thing, ever. But I mean, how do you not know Sesame Street? So yeah, that's Cookie Monster and one of the red dudes. Here is the forest again. I love these blue and white lights. They just look amazing. And this awesome tree right here. Glacier bar. And that's where we got that South Pole. Okay. The South Pole vanilla chiller. Vanilla chiller. Altitude Burgers in the Christmas spirit. Check it out.
And this tree is all done up in vintage bulbs. That is way cool. Altitude Burgers, man, just looks awesome. This place also looks way cool. And over here, more, looks like blue and white snowflakes. Behind that is a tree with blue and white ornaments hanging from it. Let's zoom in on that, that looks awesome. Yeah, that's pretty freaking spectacular right there. That is very cool. And over here we've got Rudolph the Red Nosed Reindeer. Looks like this is the Christmas Village. Check it out. Wow. Oh, this is so awesome. This is like one of my favorite movies ever. It's definitely my favorite Christmas movie. Check this all out. Oh my goodness. Wow. This is spectacular. Just look at this. Whoa. This is so awesome. There's Bumble. And you can meet Bumble and have your picture taken with him. This is so awesome. A trip down memory lane. And then here's Rudolph. Yeah. You can meet Rudolph as well. Rudolph and Bumble holding it down. Look at his shiny red nose. That is so cool. Wow. And just look at this. What a fantastic experience this is. Over here. All right. Um, excuse me, sir. Are there any drinks or anything down here? Are there any food or drinks down here? Okay. Cool. Thank you. Wow. Check out this little path here. Hey, honey. Check it out. Rudolph. This is so cool. Ready, Rudolph? Rudolph's Christmas Town at SeaWorld. And here we go. Treat your elf. Oh my god, look at this. Wow. And again, look at these trees out here in the water. Yeah, this is the hot toddy. Oh, okay.
You're a ton, honey. Um, you can stand here and I'm gonna see what else is down here. Okay. okay. Sounds good. Wow. It's like a little Christmas door here. Ginger wants the hot toddy, so I will be standing in this line. Stella with Rudolph. Thank you. Oh, that was awesome. You want to go meet Bumble now? Oh, thank you. Here, honey. All right, and now we're gonna go back to this little Christmas village, um, which is located right outside of the Rudolph area, Rudolph's Christmas Town. That's what that sign says. So here's another little village with merch and drinks and stuff awesome
so nicely done here. Wow. I'm just blown away with what SeaWorld has done. I don't think there's a vlog out there that could really do this place justice. It's just truly spectacular. Um, better than anything I could have expected. I am honestly amazed. Merry Christmas from SeaWorld. <clears throat> we still have some merch to pick up. So, uh oh. Oh well, wow. here is something I did not notice before. A little train. Oh, that's interesting. Very cool. We have to pick up our merch. Oh shoot, really? Is this the exit of the park? Uh, yeah, I think so. Crap. The flame craft bar was right there, it said. Do what? The flame craft bar, but that's where our stuff is at the exit, right? Oh well, and another Christmas village and uh, train. That's awesome. Look. This area of the park just looks spectacular. We're gonna run down here and get another look. Stop! Oh, beautiful. Thank you for checking out this video. 
please hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. You can also follow us on Instagram, and we'll see you on the next adventure. Bye, everybody.